What is going on guys? My name is James or thanks see ya and welcome to your weekly Minecraft snapshot update and today we're going to be taking a look at Minecraft 12w39a. Now this snapshot was released much later than usual and there was a lot of speculation whether it would actually come out or not due to the fact the Jeb is currently on holiday but it did come out it was published by someone else however there really really is not that much in this snapshot it is a very very small one but for the sake of you know keeping you guys up to date every week I thought I'd just show you some of the very very basic features that have been introduced into it. Now, it completely revolves around a new lighting system, and I use the word new here very tentatively because it's kind of just a lighting tweak in my opinion, it's nothing too sort of trailblazing, but um, you know, it is something that could potentially be quite cool. So, uh, quickly before we look at that, just one thing that I did notice they changed is they have fixed the, the animation sound for when blocks are placed, which is the glass block here. Oh my god, that's the wrong button. There we go. You can see that it just makes the normal noise. Now, in previous snapshots, I think it was 28A, although I don't know if they fixed it in 28B. No, 38A and 38B. Uh, when you place the, the block, it made this noise. Which is obviously pretty annoying. But, uh, yeah, anyway, we're going to be taking a look at the lighting effects. So, so what it does is it allows light to interact better with slabs and with stairs. And to kind of let light... Um, sort of seep through them and sort of emanate out of those spaces. So, for example, here we have one torch underground like so. Now, I'm going to be using some stone bricks here, but as you can see, if I block it up, it is completely blocked up. There is no light leaking anywhere from it. However, if I use this stone slab, for example, you'll see that the lighting pretty much stays normal in and around the entire area. Now, this is something new, and uh, to be honest, if you would have told me this was a change, I wouldn't have noticed it anyway, <laughs> because it's just something that I've never really even realized. But, you know, if you block it up, it's fine. And then if you place one slab down, for example, it does allow the light to come through the top. So another one is uh, this, for example, is it, it's one block in, in size. However, these are staircases. So this is a staircase, this one, this one, and this one. They're all placed sort of on top of each other. And physically, I suppose, in the older versions of Minecraft, this would not be a space for light to pass through. However, I can place a torch there, and as you can see, that the light is emanating through the front, and, uh, you know, it's kind of, it's not really spilling around the back, but it's certainly coming out of the front. So, uh, you could sort of incorporate this into your builds and designs, and still get a little bit of light coming out of the front. So, uh, what's, what's the use of this, really? Well, I only found one particular use, which would be something a little bit like this. Uh, this could be some kind of low-level lighting for sort of staircases or passageways. I mean, you can't see any torches here at all because they're up on this level here. However, with the use of the slabs, I can kind of leave the spacing here and then light will pass through it. So, if you will indulge me, you could have like one of these on this side, one of these on this side. And then you could be running through the middle and, you know, you could keep your areas lit up without having to have, you know, physical torches placed everywhere. Now, just one more thing I want to talk about. I did see all of these sort of designs on the Minecraft forums, uh, but someone was talking about there was this bug where light sort of kind of passes through either slabs or with staircases, and, uh, you know, this is a really good feature. Now, I personally think that this will be removed in the next snapshot uh, or updated because it is technically a bug. However, um, let me have a look. Now, these are my... These are my torches up here, so let me try and... I can't remember exactly how they did it. Yeah, it was something something similar to that. Yeah, as you can see, there is a very, very small band of light that is leaking through these stairs here. And this is also the case if you place them with slabs. Um, so people were showing these um, sort of like lightless rigs, basically, where they were showing light passing through certain slabs without having to have any torches visible and it being a completely closed space. I do really, really suspect that this will be removed fairly quickly as it is a bug. So, yeah, I wouldn't get your hopes up too much about that. But, uh, yeah, that is it for this snapshot uh, update. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry it's a small one, but as, as you might have heard, Jeb is on holiday. So, you know, what can you do? But yeah, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope it was useful and stuff. Uh, incidentally, if this is the first time you've ever seen any of my videos, my name is James, or thanks, see ya. And if you'd like to see a little bit more from me, uh, it'd be awesome if you consider subscribing to the channel and there's a creeper, hello sir. But uh, yeah, I do a lot of these uh, snapshot updates once every week, and I do mod spotlights and let's plays and adventure maps, game songs and parodies, all that jazz. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. It has been a pleasure. As always, thanks and see ya.